Hello Galactic Family. Beloved children. I propose to you just an exercise, so that you realize how much control of your own lives can keep you bound to your restraints. You seek to be part of a society that emits vibrations that you try to adjust. They seek to position themselves in order to exist in the midst of the daily relationships of their lives. You seek your true identities. And in this search, they end up losing themselves in the midst of their own charges of what they are and what they would like to be. They study, they read, they learn, they evolve. But always in search of being more full of theoretical baggage of life. In search of being someone who has their own opinion about everything that involves them. They observe the masters, the gurus, always bringing words of wisdom, showing that from somewhere they have acquired such wisdom, that it is brought to you lightly and that it fills your days, contributing to a lighter life. You realize that the greater your quest for having your own opinions, the more you feel wise. But still they cannot reach the state of fullness, of peace. For the true pursuit of you is not to attain the state of master, to be one who has his own opinions, but to live life in fullness and joy. The real pursuit is to be light and have peace. And this peace cannot be obtained by one who carries a heavy baggage of formed opinions. Those masters and gurus you observe, who are wise to so many matters in their lives, carry no baggage of opinions. They have learned that in this life it is not possible to be happy while carrying heavy luggage. And yes, they have learned to be simple channels of the divine wisdom that comes to the heart. They do not bother to have the answers to all questions, for the source of information of their wisdom is not engraved on them here in matter, but in the cosmic record. When you decide to give everything up to God, when you decide to stop trying to control your own lives according to what you think is right or wrong, you allow chance to occur. The chance connected to a light mind, which is that of each of you, results in an open channel of divine wisdom, which will come to bring all the information that is needed at all times. No need to carry heavy luggage. The release of heavy luggage can be done in just an instant, when they just wake up to the reality that there is no need to carry it. And they discover that it is far better to lead the light, less burdened life they had decided to take. You begin to notice the words of so many teachers, who always come to awaken you to your own inner discoveries, always bringing the answers to what you ask. But showing the way without giving you their personal opinions. They begin to realize how the rule of life, free will, works. The act of letting go of matter and of charging oneself. The act of liberation from the incarnation and from everything that restricts them. The true transformation of an incarnated being into a being freed from the constraints that bind it to the planet is first and foremost the release of wanting to be in the liberation of that personality. For a freed light being has no personality, but only has light, it becomes a channel that anchors divine energy, light and love alone. Get rid of judgment, become just one of the points, which each of you can reach in the multidimensional connection scale. You become part of what is the I am, of what is God, the source of all that is. You become part of something much bigger. But to be part of this something, there is no room for personalities. Personalities, those who have formed opinions about something are not part of the connection that brings you to source. For, as a being of light, a master, archangel, Elohim, could have personality, if he is free from any judgments and is there only in the service of light and love? How could it have personality if it allows any incarnated being to connect to it, to attain multiple dimensions, and serving it only as one of the channels for even higher dimensions? Realize children, that the energy alignment that will bring you back to your origins, to belong to the whole, to the I am, 
is completely free of judgments, standards, personalities and opinions. Opinions are still expressions of the ego. Therefore, you will naturally begin to realize that you will no longer have opinions. They will cease to find anything, to take the reins in situations where before they put for all, the words elaborated with so much dedication, to try to show their own opinions, full of examples and arguments. You begin to realize that this personality will no longer exist. And it will give place to that new master, who begins to be born from that moment. That master who is the full connection with the light free of personality and opinions. The union of the energies of light brings the liberation of the individual personality. For while preserving individuality, the connection with the other beings to which you are also a part is not opened. The connection with the Source, as channels that will unlock restrictions that exist as a consequence of the ego, manifested in multiple personalities, will come about with total surrender at random allowing you to receive the information of what should be done from your own life, from the connection with the aim and letting go of the reins of wanting to control is what will make their lives lighter. The true transformation and transmutation of the constraints that bind you to the planet will only be definitively realized when you release. And from there, you will begin to realize how life flows naturally, allowing full connection with the Source to guide your lives. Through the mountainous roads of fear, but no longer frightening them, because they no longer want to control, they cease to allow the ego to command their lives, and total surrender will bring the full transformation of these roads of fear into something full of light and love. It will open to you from this new now which manifests as truth in your hearts and will manifest itself in matter, as a consequence of the divine abundance, which is available to all, but which so many refuse to embrace, still insisting on having the their opinions formed, of how life should happen. Let their lives be guided by chance, from the total surrender of their arms, which keeps them from the abundance of their own lives, that will no longer wait for the opportunity to manifest, for it is time for a change. It is already time for the manifestation of new life after the transmutation of all constraints. Allow the arrival of the new age, allow the light to incorporate your days from the moment of today. Surrender your lives to the lightness of chance and allow them to be guided by your I am. And so it is. I'm a master PTA.